this is a demo of 2XB which uh, communi will communicate uh, wirelessly without the, the aid from a microcontroller. The 2XB is configured uh, separately and will communicate uh, wirelessly. 1XB on the left is configured as a transmitter and on the right the XB is configured as a receiver. On the left, when the, once the uh, button is pressed, the uh, transmitter XB will send a uh, high signal to the receiver which then the receiver will process that signal to provide a uh, voltage source for the LED and the LED will uh, light up. Let's press the button. So let's talk briefly about the how the wiring is set up. Let's start with the uh, receiver. Uh, try to go through the uh, data sheets and the schematic of uh, an XB and you will know that uh, pin number one is the uh, supply pin of the uh, XB. The XB can accept maximum of 3.3 volts. So as shown pin number one is connected via this red wire I'm pointing at to a uh, positive source from a battery and we know that uh, pin number 10 is a, a a ground connector so we connect that via this green wire to a, a negative source from the battery the pin in between have their own different functions but is not necessary for this setup so we leave it uh, that way unconnected on the other side of the XB most of these pins from pin 11 to pin 20 are uh, digital or a data input and output pin but uh, for this setup we're going to utilize only pin number 20 and this is pre-configured using the XCTU software as an input pin an input pin uh, if you are aware about digital input and output with microcontroller an input pin can receive either a high or low signal that is either a positive 3.3 uh, volts or 0 volts so it is high when it receives a positive supply and it is low when it receives a uh, zero voltage or a ground source. So the rest pin 19 up to pin 11 we will not utilize. So same with the uh, receiver, the uh, pin number 10 is connected to the ground and pin number 1 is connected to the source. and we use pin number 20 as a digital output pin which uh, when set to high by the XB will uh, provide a voltage source for the LED to to light up the other end of the LED is connected the positive end or the positive uh, the anode is connected by a blue wire through or going to pin 20 and the negative leads or the cathode is connected to the ground via these two green wires so let's start with the uh, uh, wiring setup for the transmitter uh, the pin 20 as a digital input is uh, getting uh, input uh, input source from 
this button so the button is can be uh, can supply an input data to pin 20 in two ways when it is pressed and with is when it is released or unpressed by default the button is unpressed and we have a wire connected to pin 20 the blue wire and connected to a uh, resistor in series going to the ground that means that the pin number 20 by default is uh, connected to ground and that means it is in a low state or zero volts so that is via the blue wire series with the resistor and connected to the ground now when the button is pressed the other side of the button is connected via this red wire to a positive source meaning when the button is pressed the red wire and the blue wire will be a will be connected meaning a positive source from the red wire passes through the button when pressed will pass through the blue LED and provide a positive voltage to pin 20 which makes pin 20 in high state now the uh, resistor will uh, serve as a a, a pull down resistor to uh, protect the uh, over current of pin number 20 and the button so most of the current will be uh, will be dissipated via this resistor to the ground whereas the voltage will be uh, go will go through pin number 20 when the button is pressed so depending on the input of the button the pin 20 will be either high or low when it is low it's sending a low signal to xb receiver so the xb receiver when it is low receiving a low signal it will provide a low state on the pin 20 that means zero volts so when the xb receiver receives a high signal from the transmitter it will send a high signal to pin 20 that means that pin 20 is high with the 3.3 volts that will enough supply for the LED to light when button is pressed a signal of high is sent to re the receiver and the receiver XB send a high signal to pin 20 that lights up the LED when the button is unpressed pin 20 is connected only to the ground which means that is a low state of pin 20 that state is also sent to the XB receiver which uh, set pin 20 to low also that means a zero volts that switch off the LED by default so this is how the uh, configuration of two XB for a direct wireless communication without the aid of a microcontroller.